All right, hold on a sec. <laughs> Gotta make sure things are actually working. Cool. Get some casual echo in our starting stream. One, two. Microphone switch is on. Video capture obviously doesn't have anything because nothing's happening. But there we go. There's some noise. Okay, things are working. We are good. Sorry this is so rushed. Um, I basically couldn't buy food last Friday because of all the rain. And I was hoping to be able to buy food over the weekend. Um, let me just actually get some gameplay going. I was hoping to actually buy food over the weekend after I gotten back from Easter. But it just ended up that everything was still closed because it was Easter. So I couldn't actually get food until just now. So now that I've eaten something, we can go and actually stream stuff. Last time we were going to get our master's sword, so that is what we are going to do. I mean, as far as like what's been going on for the past couple of days, I mean, Easter happened. So for those of you who celebrate said holiday, happy Easter to you. And for everybody else, happy Zombie Jesus Day to you. Because that's probably all it really means. Or Bunny Day for you. Whichever is the more entertaining way to profess your faith, I guess. <laughs> Let's see. So the shtick with this place, from what I remember, is that we need a torch. And we need to follow the torch wind to guide us to the Master Sword. So as you can see, the torch is going this direction, so I'm going that way. But then the wind changes to this direction, so I go this way. And that's, that's the gist of it. That's why we keep the torch for this long. Not particularly hard once you know how to do it. It's just a little confusing if you don't know the way. I guess we'll just go this way. Still in front of me? Yeah. It's probably that one right there. Tell me this way. Some deer. you hear the little whistling, it means that the spirits are trying to come and get you, so you should probably not go the direction you're currently going. Looks like we're okay, though. I assume the deer know the way too. I don't know if that's an alternate method of following the deer. Maybe. This deer seems pretty content. Shrine nearby. It's interesting. I think we made it. Yep. There we go. That was not bad. I assume we made it. Otherwise this is going to look very silly as we get warped out of the forest. <laughs> yep, that looks right. Rock Forest. 
And the frames drop substantially. <laughs> because of all the freaking trees. Link, you are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you! <sighs> Who is that? Did I doze off again? decided to return. Better late than never. After 100 years, I'd nearly given up hope on seeing you again. Even my patience has limits, you know. That look on your face tells me that you have no recollection of me, however. I have watched over Hyrule since time immemorial. Many have referred to me over the ages as the Deku Tree. That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. The sword that seals the darkness that only the chosen might can wield against the Calamity Ganon. Believe it or not, it was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. But I must warn you to take extreme caution. The sword stands as a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. As you are now, I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. If you pretty sure we're not worried in any sort of weakened state you would surely lose your life where you stand <laughs> it's such drama <laughs> best of luck young one I don't know how close we are but we're Probably a little ways off, since we did just start the game, basically. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure we won't make it, but how many spirit orbs do we have? All right, we have three. So if I do a, a shrine, it should be literally right over here. The other side of the tree. There we go. Then we will get our orb and we will get a heart upgrade. Which will hopefully give us the master sword. If not, that is okay. Oh god, one of these. <laughs> this might take a while. It's pretty vague, but I believe the answer is how many times does said constellation appear? And then uh, the number corresponds to the torches. So if you put the ball on the first one on this side, Shows up once, two is twice, three is three times, etc. So we gotta count. So little nub 
appears one, two, three, four, five times. So that's the far end. That's cool. All right, next one is the nub with the little line next to it. That appears, God, I need like the camera for this. Nub with little lines, that's one, two, three, three. Okay, three it is. Okay. Next is the big squiggly one. I think I only see one of those there. So that's one. And then the last constellation is the really long one, which there are two of. Now we got that. I believe the chest is a continuation of that. Don't know about how much. I think we're supposed to add that many. Or we count this instead. Well, yeah, if we add the small ones, that'd be, that'd be way over. So it has to be four for the small one, one for the squiggly one, or one for the one we just, let's just do one for the long one and then four of the small one for now, since we know we need that one. So one. And this one is four instead of five. So we've got the squiggly one, which is two, and the two lines, which is also two. Yes. All right, so two twos. So this one is two. And this one is also two. Nice. I can count. <laughs> Go me. What do I get? What's my price? Pretty good. What do I not need? Probably one of these two. If we just get rid of that one. Also, I probably shouldn't be using my best weapon right now. That's fun. Need more shields, though. <laughs> I don't know if I can really go shield hunting, but it would definitely be helpful. This will give us our extra heart piece. We can try the Master Sword after that, and if we don't have it, not going to go grinding for it. I'll just make sure to try after we get more hearts. Alright. Now I believe there is a statue here for the sake of upgrading inside. But I can't quite remember. Oh, is it already that time of day? Yep. <laughs> 
Time to reset everything. Good spot to have it happen. I think that's her first one. Can't quite remember. If it has been her first one, all that happens is every every enemy in the game resets. Um, so if you ever wanted to kill something, there you go. Now you can kill it again. There's our entrance. There she is. All right. Hey, yeah, Breath of the Wild's a lot of fun. <laughs> this is my second playthrough. So I remember most of the stuff that I've found through wandering around, but as far as like the whole layout of the land, I don't have that memorized. So <laughs> there is definitely a lot to rediscover. Such as this, figuring out if I can handle this. Pretty sure I can. Yeah, it's looking like enough. Don't do it. <laughs> I'm gonna refill my hearts or no? Nice. Okay. So they at least have mercy for the first time, but it looks like we're gonna need a lot more. Just still doing your first playthrough. I have all I need, but want to get the shrines done first. There are a lot of shrines. Um, some of those are pretty hard to find too, but I definitely recommend it since the reward for getting it is pretty cool. <laughs> Yeah, 120 shrines. That sounds about right. It's either 120 or 130. And then uh, there's an end reward for it. There's also, um, I believe you get the true ending if you get all of the memories. So you'll want to get those too. They aren't too hard to find. And the Master Sword, I think you, you'll need as well. If you don't already have that. Other than that, what else is there that you can do? Oh, sick. This is a, a shield for me to use. I'm good. I'm just going to take your stuff. Thanks. <laughs> Only for trial persist. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> okay, fine. I got to get rid of, I think, a sword? Yeah. I can, I can get rid of that. That's okay. Yes, please. I kind of forget how this one works. I don't think it's super hard. I think you just have to go through and not break the weapons. So you avoid combat when you can. Well, it's been a while. Just reach the shrine. Easy. Oh, under a time limit. Okay. No? No time limit. Okay. Then we're fine. I can't unequip any of these. Just ignore it. They said I couldn't... Didn't say I couldn't use bombs. <laughs> Is that cheating? No. <laughs> okay. So we are going towards the shrine as our end goal. I believe blowing stuff up is okay. Yeah. So we're just gonna get past here. Make our way. But yeah, as, as far as other late game stuff to do, um, I like to make sure that I can go to like all of the really hostile environments too. 
I think uh, making sure that you can survive in the cold environment is a lot of fun. Because uh, there's lots of Lionels there and all that sorts of stuff. Also, being able to do combat with all the Ancients is, is fun. Pot lid. Yeah, I don't think we want that. Although it is a shield, I guess. Stop shooting me. <laughs> I'm trying to collect everything. That's Swamp. Yeah. I think that clears him out. No? Okay. Wow. Full bomb, juggle him. That's fine. The only prerequisite was that I don't use all the weapon. That is okay. Fire bats, that's pretty bad. <laughs> if they touch me, then we'll burn our weapons, so don't want that. Strafe, strafe, strafe. That's one. That's two. Alright. Did not break? He didn't break. Weak weapon? Maybe? They just have a lot of HP. What the heck? <laughs> Run! <laughs> Run! I can't drop. I guess I have to kill him because if he takes contact with me, I'll drop my weapons. Run! <laughs> Uh, just casually juggle these and go. That's one way. <laughs> there's apparently one behind? Yeah, there's one still there. Okay. Don't freeze me out. I'm not a fan of the uh, of the reflect shot for those guys. I'd rather just kill them outright, honestly. I don't think the chest is worth it. Looks like we're almost there. Huh? Yep, there it is. Okay. Should probably bomb. Why why do I hear the enemy sound? Who's near me? Oh I see. There's fire arrows nearby. Yeah, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Okay. Who had there he is, okay. <laughs> okay. I wonder what the sequel of this game is gonna look like. I would do two, honestly. Like it's gonna be really hard to beat this. For the sake of like scope. But they said, from what I remember, that uh, Zelda's are going to take a lot of inspiration from this game from now on. Oh my god, okay. So, we can expect a lot more big Zeldas, I feel. I'm just going to go. This isn't worth it. But... No, 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 they put me at the start, you monsters. That's crazy. Alright, well, we have enough food to reset. That's fine. I feel like the next Zelda should be... I hope they make the Master Start. Yeah, I feel like the Master Start being unbreakable would have been a nice quality of life thing. Because it's not that OP. It's only a 30 damage weapon, so it's not like gonna break the game or anything. But, uh. Having to wait for it to recharge for the sake of, like, going through Ganon's castle is kind of annoying. The only. The upside for that, though, is that when it comes to, um. The final encounter with Ganon, if you don't already have charge 
they will give you the full master sword. Even if I, I don't even remember this spot. Where is this? <laughs> How did I get here? <laughs> huh. Can I? Yes, I can. Okay. Or not. I don't have fire arrows, so I can't, like, traverse that way. I guess we just go around. Yeah, you're more inclined to want to use other weapons, so you don't just always use the Master Sword. That's probably why they did it. It just feels kind of bad to be like, well, the, the best sword in the game is something that you can't use all the time. <laughs> wow, that's a huge shortcut. What the heck? Already there. I'm just gonna ignore that stuff. Heck no. I'm going this way. I also feel like if you could use the Master Sword all the time. Um, oh, sick. If you could use the Master Sword all the time, then uh, you would be a little bit too well equipped for the sake of Guardians, which would be kind of bad since they're supposed to be like the most scary enemy in the game <laughs> so you you'll want to fear them for quite a while before they actually become easy fights all right It would be kind of, do you know, it's actually harder than, I think the Lionel are actually harder than Ganon himself. Yeah, definitely. The Lionels are way harder than Ganon because Ganon is easily, um, I guess, spammable with the Master Sword and doesn't really take much prediction to fight, but the Lionels take a little bit more uh, actual interaction. Although you can spam the Lionels pretty hard with a good enough bow. Um, if you get any bow and shoot them in the head, it'll stun lock them. So as long as you have the arrows and enough bow charges and enough bow strength, you can pretty much just shoot them over and over again until they die. Um, so it, it kind of depends on what your gear is, I feel. But Ganon is like ubiquitously, ubiquitously easy. Is that the word? Um, so no matter like what your gear is, as long as you have the Master Sword and all the upgrades, you should be fine. Although I fear, I fear for the dude who goes in early and then like decides that they want to fight Ganon and all of the abominations paired with them without getting the guardians to help. That'd be, that'd be hard. <laughs> My strategy is to freeze them with stasis and I'm bomb airing them, lather, rinse, repeat. Uh, does the does the bomb arrow still stun them when you freeze them with stasis or no? I haven't I haven't really tried stasis in them too much because the time is basically just enough for like a full sword combo or something. So I I don't focus on that too much. What can we do? Why don't we just go in some random area area that has no bearing into the actual plot? <laughs> Let's go down. I like the forest area a lot. can get the uh the one c city there i believe it stuns me up I feel bad i haven't touched this game the last time it streamed it months ago well yeah i mean it's definitely hard to pick the game up if you haven't played it for a while but it's it's not too hard to relearn i know there are, i i have a friend at work who who's kind of the same way as you who uh picked it up and got burned out and they just doesn't have the motivation to play it anymore yeah. <laughs> it's too fun of a game not to complete. I feel. There's just so much you can do. So what is this? This is the wind area. I want to go to the forest area. Oh, this seems like Lake Kelia would be kind of nice. And that will lead us to the forest area, which is also over here. Okay. I think we can make it through Lake Kelia alive. That seems like a pretty easy ask. 
How do I want to go about it? I guess we can just go down. Go across the bridge. I know there's a, there's a quest that I could get at the island. I guess we can just do that. I know there's like the one Zora who's there who I already interacted with. And then uh, by doing that we can get something later. But it's not super important. I'll get it since we're here. Pretty sure is at this island shrine nearby. Must be at here. Favorite location in the game if I have one. I think it's somewhere tied between uh, Tabitha and um, the the forest area we're going to now. I just like the forest area just because of, like the jungle environment's just kind of cool. But I like Tabitha just because it's it's like treacherous and like kind of uncharted when you first get into it because the map is uh is not always really close to where you first enter tabitha kind of the same way with the canyons uh the map isn't always necessarily going to be uh, available to you when you first go there so you like beach town beach town is cool <laughs> i actually got to beach town pretty late because i i ended up uh getting to the forest in post game like i I uh, I found the uh, area, but then didn't get Beach Town until way later. Is he coming at me? I should probably take off this wood gear, huh? Wood gear is actually pretty good. Come at me. We're actually pretty low on arrows. I'll probably have to find Beetle soon. So it's in here? I don't remember this one at all. <laughs> oh. oh, I guess that's probably why I don't remember it. <laughs> How long have I been a streamer for? I've been a streamer for, I guess, a little over a year now. I've done it every day, Monday through Friday, for the most part. And the time used to be closer to UK because I was on night shift, but now it's it's closer to EST because I've switched today. Um, I stream every day from six to eight weekdays been pretty consistent i streamed hearthstone a lot at the start i still stream hearthstone a lot but i like to kind of vary it just so i don't get burned out on the same game over and over again i found that happened a lot with hearthstone is that i would just i'd stream it so much i'd just be like oh god the meta i can't take this anymore and then i'd have to like motivate myself to stream this way is a lot more fun because I can just pick a game. Your one year is coming out soon. Quit about a month ago. Going to get back into it. Close to 560 followers. It's a fun hobby. Yeah, it's definitely a fun hobby. I'm still trying to get the affiliate, but once affiliate is met, that will be a good milestone. Uh, oh. There we go. I don't know if I need to. I guess I don't don't really get the choice, huh? I don't have enough bomb to do it. Yeah. It's probably fine. It's not fine. I guess we could do this here. Stasis. Switch bomb. Go to the other bomb. I think we just put it the wrong way. Yeah, it doesn't work. Maybe if I go, like, nudge it under. There we go. I feel like if I marketed myself a little bit more aggressively, it would be a little bit easier to get past 50. But we're pretty close. I'm at 40. Huh. We hit one of the blocks. Do I have bomb arrows? I don't want to cheat this, but... No, I don't. Okay. So we gotta do it legit. Oh, you know what we can do? I got an idea. We, I have a great idea. We can put a bomb on top. 
right here. I can put the other bomb on the bottom. And I can stasis here, trigger this bomb, go to the other one. Um, what other games do I enjoy streaming? I like streaming Overwatch when I'm not feeling super competitive. Um, but I also like streaming Hearthstone. I like streaming single play player games. I uh, think the most recent single player game I had a lot of fun with was Wargroove. That was a blast. <laughs> I went through the whole game and did all the extra stuff. Let's see. So I guess we gotta do this again. I would definitely recommend Wargroove if you haven't played it already. There's a lot of content to it. It's pretty challenging too. Is there anything else in this place? There's one chest. We need to do that again, huh? Have to remember to go to that side. One thing I would like in this game if they were to make a sequel, is if you've ever played a Phantom Hourglass or a Spirit Tracks, you know the map and how you can write on it? That'd be awesome for a game like this. <laughs> I'd, I would love that a lot. Because then you can be like, oh, I need to go this direction for when I get up this platform, and you can make a note to yourself so that when you, you come out, you can like pause the game or something and be like, ah, that's the way I need to go, and then go that way. Uh, I don't think we need this. It's only 15. I guess what we'll do... I'll put sword here so I know. We can skip it in case I, I need a sword later. Like, I like the uh, the stamps that they have, because there's a lot of good communication you can have. But if you could write on the map with, like, any language at all, you could make, like, really nice doodles and just go crazy, which is just a big part of map, map making that's fun. Um, like, being able to make a note saying, like, there's an enemy here, here, and here at this spawn point <laughs> would be... Pretty cool. So you can like know at what angle you're supposed to go at to ambush them. Something like that. Or like there's boulders that drop from this spot. Instead of just like putting a skull on that spot, you can like mark where the boulders are actually gonna fall from. That'd be pretty cool. Alright, so we got the shrine, but I'm pretty sure there is a Zora near here. There's a chest. I missed that last time. I think she's near this side, from what I remember. Could very well be wrong. I know she's at least in Hylia. And she's swimming in the water. Somewhere around here. Some ducks. I don't have any arrows right now. I could probably do battle with them if he... <laughs> See, that? I think he's hunting the fish. That's kind of cool. Oh, there she... No, that's a duck. <laughs> there she is. That's a duck. We've done this twice now. You think... Oh, no, 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 no. That hurts. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no bows from that. My dilation alert... Yeah, I um, I downloaded that one. I forget from where. It's one of the ones they they had for like MLG and whatnot. <laughs> it's a pretty pretty good classic one. <laughs> hmm. I could have sworn she was around here. Is she on the other side? 
Is there another? I can't even see the map, I guess. Uh, I don't want to grind this. I think we'll just go up the hill. Jenny had a dollar just to see it. It's definitely, it's a lot of fun. That's why uh, if somebody does donate, I want it to be at least a good time. <laughs> I don't think I have anything else past follower and donation just because I don't think I have the ability to do anything outside of that. So once affiliate is gotten, then I can try to add more stuff past that. And there goes. There might be something on the other side. I'm not sure. Good old ice catapulting extravaganza. I can tell I've done this a lot. <laughs> He says immediately falling over. I don't think we need to climb here. Nah, I don't think we need to climb here. I know there's a memory around this spot. Near Lake Kilia. I don't remember if it's on this side or the other side though. I know it's uh it's like the the two statues next to the tree. That's the one. But uh as far as which side I do not remember. I guess since we're closer to here, I'll get the tower first. Tree. I don't see it. Oh. We'll just completely ignore all of this since we did make over it. Because fighting is for chumps. Or are they all asleep? It's only 7.15. They shouldn't be asleep yet. Weird. The most uneventful shrine get of all time. <laughs> this was way more Harris when I did this. Maybe I won the other side. I don't know. Uh, Alright. Get me up. Ah, oh, we, can, we can totally do that. <laughs> It's nice to have stamina again. <laughs> Even just that many jumps is enough. Yeah, we can't get him because we don't have a bow. Because we don't have any arrows. So he's just he's just gonna have to be a picture taken right now. I still haven't done um What's the dragon's name? Not Dim. Naru? The one that's based off of Naru. Um Just It's a lot more treacherous than the comb when you don't have the equipment, so I need to get into the bird area before I'm even going to attempt that, I think. Uh, where is the other side? There he is. Give me my dragon picture. Bam. Alright, now I can track him. I already know the good camping spots for the most part for him. This being one of them, the other being inside the forest area. Um, so, not too big a deal to have his picture. I think Din is definitely the better the better one to have the picture for. I probably should have marked that on my, my thing before I went there, huh? This is the one... I think this is the one that's connected to the big horse quest. The big black horse. 
who's in like that area. Just don't want to go into that area without having uh Oh, this is awkward. <laughs> Hello, friend. No, 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 no. You don't get to tell your friends. I guess you get to tell these friends, though. Whoa. There you go. <laughs> the bats, too, really? Such abuse. Should be less less savvy with my uh, my weapons, but <laughs> I've gotten so used to it in the late game of just being like these guys aren't worth my weapons and just throwing bombs at them. I just kind of do it by habit. Wow, there is a lot more Lucifer's than I thought there would be. Nope, nope, we're not here. Don't you worry, buddy. I know on the other side of the mountain is the objective. So we're just gonna casually go around them. Either that or we, we pull an Anakin. I have the high ground. Wow, he, he really did not see any of that, huh? The roof protection is now ready to roll. There we go. Can't really combat them without the horse. I'm just gonna ignore them for now. It ain't worth it. Sick. Yeah. Oh. Oh, is that all? Sure. <laughs> oh, you want me to mount first? It's a bit of an awkward process, but okay. idea what this is, but we're doing it anyway. <laughs> oh. So all I have to do is jump. Okay. Oh. Electric bats? That is not fair. <laughs> really? Maybe we shouldn't do it at night. I'll wait on that then. Friend, you did not warn me about the bats. You die. <laughs> A ladle? Yep. What to cook? Guess this is fine. Once you realize that these things are super overpowered, it kind of defeats the whole purpose of cooking. But, you know, we're here to win. 
We don't care how we win. Just looking in horror as I cook my food. Self with that. Alright, buddy. Cool. That's the stylist. There's Beetle. Beetle, we have we have a deal that we need to make out. No thanks. I don't have the rupees. Alright, I need to sell some stuff then. Should be able to at least sell some of the monster parts that I have. Yeah, this is fine. I don't want to wake him, but give me a pick. Yeah, we know about this one. Freaking tried to murder my horse. Oh. Speaking of people getting murdered, we should probably be on a horse for that. Do I have a good enough weapon for this? Guess these are pretty good. He's getting bombarded by people. We can't have that. Oh no. Get back out of here. He's serving as a good distraction. We well, accidentally hurt the horse, which I don't like, but sometimes you can't help it. Horse combat, let's go! No, my horse. You can't do that to me. Only I can do that. I can't stasis them while they're riding the horse, unfortunately. That used to be my strat. That's good enough. Bowmanship, buddy. Do it. I freaking dare you. Nope. Okay. <laughs> There's still more, friend. What are you doing? That should be all of them. Pretty sure. Is she actually okay this time? <laughs> Hi. I thought there was a quest for this. Do I want another horse? I don't think so. I think we'll just stick with what we got. There's Furrow again. There was a quest for killing all of those. I'm almost certain. Was it her? change the main. Floral main's kind of cool. It just 
it has a tendency to look a little bit too shaved for me. Braided mane's kind of nice. Mohawk mane. <laughs> I'll take normal. Still haven't done the shrine yet. Seems like a Magnesis. Metal door is open the way. How will he do it? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, we figured it out. Step one, open the door. Oh, they're smart. Kind of. Kind of smart. Not super smart, though. They don't take account for momentum. <laughs> so it seems. My bows. 29. Alright. Do I have to break off the door? Probably. Oh, this is one of these. I guess we'll respect that. I already take this one's picture. Yeah. Can just switch the weapon. It's probably about the same quality. Yeah. Is it though? Maybe not. Because the amount of strikes it's gonna take is double. So I guess it's better to keep the sword anyway, even at half durability. This is probably the door that they intend us to use. So we we blow it off with the bombs. And then use it as a means of transportation. Something, something. Something like that. Something like that. Pretty weak bow. But it is as good as this bow. So I guess we'll go for it. Maybe my expectations are just so high. From all my other bows. Okay. Show me the way. Large metal door. I feel cheated. <laughs> it's just barely out of reach. Dang it, game. Alright. There you go. Looks like either way is fine. Magnesis to take that too. Looks like we could have also just used the door to break the blocks, but that's no fun. <laughs> nice. Oh, 
the heck is this? <laughs> this does not look like good positioning. I don't like it. You expect me to be able to organize this door with this? This feels very silly. Maybe if you like kind of angle it, it can work. Uh, it's just the angle of this door is not turned, so. Guess we'll just have to hope gravity works at some point. Because it always holds the door this way. No, I want to hold the door that way. I want to hold the door this way. Is it smart enough to figure... Okay, it is. It's just the angle you catch it is the way in which you hold it. That's interesting. Okay. Gotcha. So one more. Okay. Well, the sun's up now. So maybe that person that we were supposed to interact with is now here? Maybe? <laughs> Actually, now we can challenge this guy in a fair duel. Instead of the madness that he was trying to make us do earlier. Let's do that. Yes. <laughs> I will beat you, sir. You cannot beat me with your bats this time. <laughs> nope, we're good. Okay. Don't want to do it. There we go. It's weird because I don't even remember this. Why don't you like this angle, friend? I don't understand. You got it. He doesn't like it. Looks like he's just okay with the normal speed. Another one that I missed? I don't see anything. Oh, over here? <laughs> this one? How do we miss this one? That's good now? Nope, there's another one.
not dropping out. <laughs> Where is this last thing? On the right? Am I blind? Where is this? Should just all be on the horse path, right? I can't see anything. Is that it? This one right here. Okay. That should be all of them. Okay, so there's ten total. Okay. Weird. We'll go again. I won't lose you, sir. We will beat you at your own game. Got it. It seems pretty generous, honestly. The goal is to go over it without speed. And to then just cart over these. the last one. Alright, so it leaves room for one mistake. Which isn't too bad. I'll go one more time. Because <laughs> I refuse to lose to Horseman. Oh, you just get this? Okay. <laughs> Give her the new saddle, though. dead friend. I killed them all. <laughs> I killed them all. They're all dead. All of them are dead. Are they all back now? Oh, there's one more. Okay. Here I come, friend. Here it comes. I have no remorse. <laughs> there you go. We got him. Where is she now? <laughs> I killed them all, lady. They're all dead. All of them are dead. Okay. One carrot. Okay, not the best. 
but sure. I guess we, if we beat his time, we get the other gear. I'll try it. We know how to beat this. One more. <laughs> Don't want to speed up for that one. Be too risky. Be this time though. Probably have to take a risk. Alright. Got him. First try, buddy. We got him. Wasn't even worried. Nice. There's the other half. I'm good. Yeah. Give me the other gear. I'd like to change the main. I don't know to what. I feel like French braided main makes sense, as does uh, just braided. Yeah, braided looks pretty good. Hmm. Let's do French. Oh, wait. Nah, I don't like the thing telling off there. Full braid. Yeah, full braid. <laughs> That looks like a professional trick horse. Look at that. Heck yeah. <laughs> the, uh, the braids look a little silly, honestly. I'm putting them back. We're going back to the normal main. Gosh dang it. I've tried it out. I don't like it. Put it back. Probably won't need that one. I haven't needed it on my past pay playthrough at all. But if this horse dies, I'll probably want to take it back. Put it back. <laughs> it is. Right here. Guess that we're not the already obvious by the name of the place. It's like Horse Gods Ravine or something like that. They make it pretty, pretty upfront. Right now, I should be able to use this horse to get all the way through the woodlands without too much trouble. Hopefully, it might rain, but. It's not that late at night. Okay, there is some rain in the forecast. That might be a problem. We shall see. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Okay, so we gotta go the long way around. I'm sorry, Oris. <laughs> I thought there would be a path here. I do like the fancy feather though. Looks very nice. Now that our horse is on autopilot, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I wanted to mention before I get distracted by the game again. We did just run over. Speaking of getting distracted by the game again, don't like wasting food. Shrine. Are you a trap? No. You're the dragon lady from before. Guess we'll get this shrine while we're here. It's a pretty in the middle of nowhere shrine, honestly. <laughs> But yeah, I can't I can't think of anything up front. My plan is still to ramp up to getting Pokemon to stream at some point. That's why we're continuing to do these sorts of things with the with the Switch. Um I don't know if there's any particular game anybody wants to see me play that I haven't played before or that I have played before. But once Breath of the Wild is done, I'll probably go into a Switch game in my library that I haven't completed. I got some for my birthday. I think this one's upgraded. It said minor test of strength. Now I use the normal one. Got a shield. Ow. Oh, he's doing the thing. He's doing the thing. Uh, yeah. I think this is the air thing, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Sick. I think I'm full on shield. <laughs> Need to drop this one. Or the pot lid, I guess. I think I'd actually rather keep the pot lid over this shield if I don't have the room. Bam. Alright. Pot lid defense. Let's go. New age defense is here. I am using the right bow. Okay. That wasn't too bad. So let's see. I still want to get the tower for this area. And I still want to do the merfolk area. That's a interesting weapon. Also interesting that we have room for it. And it has this crazy durability. Okay. It's a different durability up. I don't know what the difference between the diamond and the yellow version of that is. Like there's yellow and then there's, well, this is crit. Critical hit up. I actually don't think I've ever seen that before. But I've been playing this game for like a year. <laughs> I've never seen this upgrade now that I think about it. Huh. Okay. Yeah, all the durability ups I've seen have been yellow. Okay.
So that gets us the shrine. But we still need the tower and the shrine next to the stable is next to the tower. Which should be pretty easy access. Oh, radish. Yoink, come on now. And a horse. Thank you for waiting, horse. It's not too far in. Oh, yeah, we're, we're going past that. Get out of here, horse. You can try and hit this horse all you want. He's too fast. He's too fast for you. Hello. It's Cass. It is probably better for us to shoot Farosh before we even attempt that. Because I believe we need the scale to open one of the secret shrines there. So I'm not going to do that just yet. It's a lady. It's the same lady. <laughs> Why are you always here? Hmm. Well, there's our goal. Let's see how easy it is to get to it from here. It looks like it's pretty easy to get to. Might be surrounded by some crazy stuff, but getting to the shrine is easy. Somebody help. Well, we know what that means. Get the heck away from my friend. Wow. Really? Hey, replacement club. <laughs> Are you okay? You're probably the truffle people, aren't you? Out in the middle of nowhere, like you always are. Yep. <laughs> no reward for me. Can't believe we're alive. Well, maybe you should stop searching for truffles in the middle of nowhere, lady. <laughs> Gosh dang. there's going to be a kid who plays this game who doesn't understand the old times of calling Link Zelda and then they're going to call Link Zelda and their parents are going to laugh freaking calling it now I was just thinking of like the scenario of like are you the Breath of the Wild the true the one true Breath of the Wild oh come on really I guess we'll take your picture now. Friend, please no. Oh, of course, better than I have. Easy. <laughs> okay, so let's take a picture of our friendly neighborhood wizard robe. We are probably going to have to deal with. I hate this guy so much. <laughs> well, that's that's pretty tall. Probably can't even get there from this point, huh? I have to do it from up higher. Which means we need to climb. We need to climb. Can't even see how high this is, but I assume it's high enough. Looks high enough. 
Yeah, it should be fun. I might need the stamina help for this. I know I have a spare, so that should be okay. We're about to be exhausted. Gotcha. <laughs> I think there is actually a Liz Fust encampment up here, which kind of sucks, but we have enough stuff to beat them. Yep. At least to some degree. These are so good, by the way. <laughs> I remember grinding these up when I first was like trying to get some equipment in the post game. Hello. He sidestepped me. That's incredible. Fall off. Alright, there's a Korok here, which we may as well get, since we already cleared out the area. Just get one of the Durians and put it right here. It's not how I intended it. No rolling, please. There you go. <laughs> Okay. Boo. Okay, this should be fun. No bat infestation going to kill me. No whiz robes to destroy me. All is well. Don't want to waste the extra stamina on this. It's not urgent. So we climb the rest of the way. Neat. Two towers down. It's the return of Farash during a cutscene. <laughs> Probably want to chase him down, might not make it in time. That's a big man. Boom. I've already lost my sense of direction for where he is. There he is. He's gonna go back into the water. I won't be able to reach him in time. There he goes. Look at him go. How does he fit in there? Don't know. Comes out at 1 a.m. from the top of that mountain and goes to that mountain every night. It's a good grinding spot for him, but you have to have a reasonable amount of swimming gear like the Zora stuff to do it. Because you gotta actually get up on top. It looks like he's gonna make his way out and back down again. We might actually be able to get there in time. Maybe. I just want to scale, so I don't have to make some super precise shot or anything. We'll see how hard this is.
Well, it hurt. But we're okay. Need to get on top of the bridge to search for where that scale went. Because he shocked me when I hit it. Didn't really get to see where it went. We did hit him. So it is somewhere near here. Maybe if I go on top of the river, I'll be able to see it better. Unless it's like right there. Kind of looks like it right it's right there, but I'm pretty sure that's just the sun being stupid. There he goes. This will be an example of a good swimming emergency. Which you will need the extra stamina. But even that might not be enough. God, just bear. Oh, no. <laughs> I made it, dang it. Don't you do that to me. Oh well, I guess this is fine. Gosh dang. I would have liked that scale. Can't see it anywhere. You can go like on top of a tree or something. Maybe. Alright, I give up. <laughs> I'm not going to waste too much time on that. There will be plenty of opportunities to shoot him and get the scale and go and get the shrine. Here's our shrine. Halt the tilt. Tilt halt. Wow. <laughs> Incredible. The chest on this side is a metal. I mean, doesn't matter all that much. Just can't magnesis it from here. So I guess we gotta wait. Okay. Cool, but it's not better than what we have, right? Boomerang is good utility. It's also got a lot of durability, which is nice. It's better than this, but we already have a lot of metal weapons, is the thing. So I think I want to keep that for the sake of like lightning storms and whatnot. I guess we'll just mark that this has a sword in it. So I'm gonna mark here. So not really. I think I'll be able to figure that out. Give me stasis. Thank you.
Hmm. Could use the chest. I guess. Uh huh. Hmm. There's no way to haul it midway. Guess that's the closest. I also need to I need to do this without stasis, so I need to catapult myself up. There's no barrels around here. I feel like the chest is kind of mandatory. So I guess what we could do is I could put force with stasis. That should be enough. Or not. <laughs> guess we need a bit more than that. We can use the uh, boomerang here, I guess. That didn't work. Do I just like jump up and down on it? <laughs> Is that the way I get the motion that I want? If I could get the chest from over here as a weight. This chest is metal, right? Yeah. Got it. Okay, we're using the chest in order to beat this puzzle. <laughs> Gosh dang it. Okay. not work as planned. <laughs> I guess we could just use the chest as a way, huh? Instead of doing this fancy thing. It kind of works. I guess we need it the other way around. So you leave the chest on this end. Leave the chest on this end. Leave the chest on this end. There we go. That's still not high enough, though. I need it to launch me. I guess there's also, for the sake of completing it, can use the chest as the weight here and then stasis the other. So that'll complete the, the stage. Nice stasis this. That works. That one isn't metal though. I'm gonna complete it first so I don't have to worry about doing this again. I have to come back for the other run anyway, so if I want if I want the other chest, it's fine. I don't want to waste my whole time on this one stage. <laughs> so now I go to the village. Surprised that a boomerang can cut the grass. <laughs> the 
the mustache. We had left them at the tower before, so I need to need to fast travel them here. And the village should be this way. That is a Korok. that shield upgrade. <laughs> Only having room for three is kind of silly. I also would like to find more shields. I haven't really been the many shield drops as of late. There's some bananas. Bananas! Banana rush over. About the rain. Get me out of here. My stuff all wood. Yes. Sick. Don't gotta worry about it unless we randomly get struck by lightning on the way over, which could very well happen, which is why I want to get out of here. That is a trap. Almost positive this is a trap. Step right up and buy the bananas. Don't have enough money. Oh. a little OP. There we go. Alright, we use this enough times, I think we switch it. Hello. Eh, can find all that stuff. Okay. That looks like there's nowhere we want to go. Just guess we're going this way. All these travelers. My horse is spitch. This is the right way. Person getting attacked. We can't have that. Just standing in awe. Okay, buddy. Oh, thanks. Oh. Uh. Can't swim. Ugh. You know, I could not swim for like up until up until I was like in middle school, and then I just had like a moment where it clicked at me at uh, summer camp one year. 
It's like, oh, I can swim now. Ta-da. <laughs> that wasn't so hard. I just didn't get it, I think. It just didn't make any sense to me. Like, what were they trying to ask me to do? And I was like, oh, that's what they're trying to ask me to do. And I did it. It was fine. Now we've made it, but we need the shrine here. Should be nearby. Can I pass it on the way over? Might have. Alright, horse, we're going to get that shrine. top of this hill. So I guess we make a hard right. Something like that. It's not up here, is it? No. He sees me. Don't see me for long though. like it's up here. This could be entirely wrong. But that is what seems to be the case. At the very least, it is closer this way, since we will have the high ground. Seems as if it is directly below me. Something to that degree. It's not up here, so I guess we jump. Don't see a shrine. There it is. All right, we got it. I'm a little bit up, but not too far up. All right, this will be how we end for today. Weighty decision. Well, is it just as simple as put the weight on the other weight? Oh yeah. Easy enough. I don't know if I've taken this one's picture yet. I have. Oh, this is the, the other version. Okay. Taking the crit one because I still don't know what it does. <laughs> cool. Think that is better than the sickle. Yep. Okay. of a misjudge of depth. There we go. Did 
Just in case I want this. Now I have it. How heavy is this sickle? I don't know. Apparently heavy enough to do that. Not heavy enough to counter my weight. <laughs> Obviously. So I have to use the chest. Is that the, the gimmick here? This chest isn't even metal. Maybe I have to use the other chest. Seems like it. Not too hard. I don't think there's anything in particular to explore in the town at the start, so I do think we are basically done for today. Maybe we'll get the Spirit Orb upgrade and try the Master Sword before the stream ends. I'm pretty sure we need more than what we have, though. I know they do have a shrine down here somewhere. That crab waving at me. <laughs> Pick me up, please. I demand it. Pretty sure it's like surrounded by fire and stuff, and it's really obvious. The shrine, that is. Hmm. I know they do have one. Taking all for you, goodbye. Fishing harpoon. Cool. Where is the thing? That's a pretty strong bodor. <laughs> bodor is no joke. We're inadvertently exploring this beach. Thought I knew where the shrine was, but apparently I don't. Because I think I would have run into it by now. Maybe I'll go to bed. I'm an old man. <laughs> Crab. Thank you. 
wish there was like a shrine detector. There it is. Okay. We found it. We try it again. We tried. Game over. Sword too powerful. So we probably need like one or two more, looks like, before we can go for it. We're close. Oh well, good save. Don't even have to do it. We already got that save point. So for next stream, I have planned to do Overwatch so that I can do more of the uh, legendary all characters run. Hi. Oh, that's a lot of these, geez. Oh. Um, but uh. It'll also let me get the loot boxes at the same time as we complete the quest, which will be helpful. Anyway, that is for next stream. This will probably be on again on Friday, because I'm also planning to use this with friends off stream for my own devices with Phoenix Wright, like I described, I think, in the previous casual uh, Breath of the Wild stream. I guess this is now a fish catching stream. <laughs> we catch fish now, nothing else. Okay, that's really it though. Time to stop. See you tomorrow.